Hi and welcome to Abstract My Perspective. I am Brio Rayshawn and this is my co-host Cairo that does not come to work most of the time. Anyway, today we have a haul for you, so let's get into it. So, I have a haul for you guys. It is Van Jane. I know, I know, it is another exclusive Van Jane haul because they have blessed me yet again. If you have not, follow them on Instagram. They do Instagram sales. And if you are in the greater LA area, they also do flea markets. They do um, pop-ups. They do all of these fun things where you can shop in person with them. Just put your mask on. Just, just put your mask on. But anyway, I have some stuff for you guys. Now, I've been shopping them for a while. They do sell men's clothes, so don't be scared. They do sell men's clothes. And uh, yeah, so this is in no particular order. I am just gonna go through. Got a package for them, and I didn't open it. So let me open it now. Look how cute they package them. They have a little card with a cute thank you note. Cute little string. And I love people that package very tight. So. Wow, okay, so I have a Pucci shirt. Get into it or get lost. Um, it smells really good too, actually. I love it. I'm excited. It's, it's Pucci, so I haven't owned any Pucci. I love how this Pucci shirt fits. Like, it's super soft, it's nice and short so I don't have to worry about it being oversized and it's just tight and nice. I love it. I also have a jumpsuit. You know how I feel about jumpsuits. You know how I feel about jumpsuits. Play suits. This is definitely given bathing ink, but this isn't by bathing ink. This is by staff back. Yeah, I don't know. This is probably like the legit army fatigue camouflage. Cairo, get out of my lap. Thank you. Do you think it's cute? That that's my leg. I have the one cat that does not climb on people, so I can literally tell him that is my leg. Hey, you won't climb on me. This fit is really, really good. I love that it's cropped leg and I like the big print for sure. I was so excited to get these pants and they look just as cute in person. Okay? These are so dope. Cannot wait to put them on my body. And they have like a little pocket right there. Like so like this. I do love the way they fit. They are a little Tight though, I'm not gonna lie. It's not Louis Vuitton. I got a Hermes scarf. Um, it's like a handkerchief moment. I love Hermes's prints and stuff, so this is gonna be cute. And I have something to wear it with for a handkerchief you'll see later in the future. But um love this. Love this. This is my new little go-to style for handkerchiefs, just tied on a little tank top. If you want to see a tutorial, please comment below. But I love this little print and just a new way to tie a little tie or scarf. I finally went outside and I went to Melrose Trading Post for the first time. And it was because Van Jan was there. And I had to pick up some goodies. So I had to pick these up. How freaking cute are these shimmery pants? I recently wore them to a bonfire and I haven't gotten to rewash them because they smell like fire. So I'm going to throw them this way. My Find Your Way Back pants, I love them. I love the way they fit. The first time I wore them, I had to get used to like the actual fabric, but now I really love that. I love giving a Beyonce sparkle moment and I wish they were a little longer, but it's okay. I also got this beauty 
And if you don't know, if you can't tell by the fact that I'm living with a tiger that is doing something weird on the floor, I love wildcats. Now, zebras is clearly not a wildcat. It is on the back of the shirt. I like them too, but um, and giraffes and safaris and stuff, but I really, 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 really love wildcats. So, no Carol Baskin here though, but I love it. So, I love a button up worn so many, so many ways. A tutorial is coming very soon on how I like to style my tops but yeah it fits really cute i love the sleeves i didn't even realize they had bubble sleeve but that's my favorite part about them beside the print i got this cute little jumpsuit throwback moment it's short it's gonna be adorable this little play suit and i love this play suit the most I am giving Ray Jean Hunter, I am giving Whitley Gilbert, and I am happy about it. I love this suit. It is so 90s. It is so me. It fits perfect. If you hear some sounds in the background, it's because it's construction, and I refuse to not film because I have no idea when they're going to stop. But also, I got this cute little number. I don't know how it works, but there it is. That is this cute little number, which I'm extremely excited about because I wanted more like fun, clubby, I don't go to clubs, but like lounge bar dresses. I just felt like I didn't have enough. And I'm also weird enough to want to wear this with some sneakers and some Converse. And this will look so cute with the duster too, so. Lately I've been into these little saucy dresses and this one is very interesting because I don't know if I was styling it wrong, but the side of it is an interesting cut so it's not exactly identical on both sides, but whatever, it's cute. Then, I like Rick Owens, but I don't usually buy a lot of high-end designers just because I just don't sometimes, but, um, and I never... I haven't found Rick Owens pieces secondhand that I really, really love yet, or I have seen and loved but didn't buy them secondhand, blah, blah, blah. So this actually was giving me that vibe, and I love it because it's a huge, like, perfect for the airport, perfect for the beach, perfect just like a moment, literally, a, a definite moment. I am so excited about this particular duster because of the ruching and the ruffles and it looks so cute with this look but I'm gonna be honest with you I can't wait to pair this with like a white tank and some jeans or with all black outfit or something like that it just is a really good staple to have in my closet for sure I only bought this shirt because I have pants that looks just like this just like this I actually wore those pants in my last video but yes, they look just like this. And I was like, I live for a set. Like, two-piece, live for it. And there's a weird thing that happens with me where I can literally own something and then later find something that matches exactly. And it's like, did you do this on purpose? And it's like, no. It's a 10-year, 5-year, 3-year gap of me owning one item and the other item. I just feel like it's like a love story. But with clothes, they find each other. I love sets, I love two pieces. So the fact that I found this maybe two, three years apart makes me so excited. I love the gray, I'm sorry, the gold color and I just like how it looks tucked in or tucked out. My favorite. They gifted me these, which means a lot to me because I like the color green. And for my day job, um, part of our uniform now is green shirt. Um, I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm not okay. I'm okay, but anyway. Uh, it's as bad as you think because I don't like uniforms but I thought these would be really cute to wear for work and they gifted me these and I really really love them these fit cute love them I like crop legs because I'm tall so I don't really need a long long pant and I don't really like it but I love these they fit so cute look at my booty yes <laughs> speaking of this is basically getting into like cute but also work section these shorts love them they're like a green kind of color but they also go really nicely with the top so that also matches and I love a monochromatic look I'm here for it I love it I love it 
Sign me up for an oversized dad short. I love the 90s just for this alone. Just for this alone. So, I needed leather pants. And when I actually physically went to shop with the Mad Melrose Trading Post, they had so many leather pants. And I've always wanted multiple colors of leather pants, like red, blue, green, forest green. Such a great little item to just pull and wear. So I found these and I'm really excited. Don't know how they fit yet. Um, they had like a little mark on them, but I still bought them because I really like them. They had other pairs, but something about this is lamb. I am vegetarian, but I'm not opposed to wearing leather. Um, and they have like this raw edge at the bottom. I live, okay. The leather fits me like a glove. I love how it fits. It also hits that ankle. Um, I'm not gonna lie to you. I had to like shimmy into these. I'm hopping into jeans these days So I do feel Beyonce's pain, but I love the way they fit. They fit so cute and again my favorite little shirt made in appearance <sighs> These give me a riding pant ho give me one and then they have the high I don't even know what this is in the back. It, I thought it was a pocket but these high riding pants, I'm so excited. They are perfect. They are super expensive if you want them firsthand. I don't even know what this brand says. I really hope all of this thickness can fit in them, okay? Quarantine thick is a thing. And I am standing by it and I am happy about it. So yeah, so um these are really good pants. Listen, I jumped into these two, but they fit so cute. I'm hoping that this little stain that's on them comes out, but I love them. Thank you so much for watching today's video. Thank you so much for subscribing, liking, and sharing with all your homegirls. Like I said, follow me on Instagram because on there I give you real content, okay? I give you content to hold you over to the next Sunday. I'm talking editorial pictures and photo shoots. I'm talking how-to videos and how to be cute. And I'm talking pure humor on my Insta story. So follow me. Also follow me on TikTok because I'm slowly but surely also trying to do more TikTok videos. So follow me there. And thank you so much and bye. Oh, wait. Follow Van Jane. It's imperative that you do that. Okay, bye.